Okay, so let's see what we got here. If I type this command, sudo, oh gosh, sudo, uh, Python say.py, and let's see what happens. Waking up Arduino. It's 22.6 degrees Celsius, and I'm looking east. Looking east. Okay, so what happens if I rotate like this? Now we have to wait a second. It's 22.6 degrees Celsius, and I'm looking east. Okay, so I think it read that too soon, but we'll just see. Rotate a little bit more. Yeah, there we go. It's 22.6 degrees Celsius, and I'm looking south. Now I'll do it like this. It's 22.6 degrees Celsius, and I'm looking west. And when I do it like this, I have to catch it before it makes the reading. Yeah. It's 22.7 degrees Celsius, and I'm looking north. And so I think I know what the directions are now around here. It's 22.7 degrees Celsius, and I'm looking west. It's kind of funny how it has a different inflection depending on which way it's looking. Now I might have not caught it this time around, but let's see. Yeah. It's 22.7 degrees Celsius, and I'm looking north. I think it read it when it was like oriented like this because this should be should be eastish, I think. It's 22.7 degrees Celsius, and I'm looking east. Okay, I'm going to turn that off for a little bit so I can explain what's going on here. What do we have here? We have um, an Arduino, and if you ignore the keyboard, um, which is actually, it's, I'm using it for debugging, but it's also a USB hub. So the Arduino is connected via USB into one of the ports on the Raspberry Pi. The other port is the Wi-Fi dongle, which is um, using, which we're using to connect to the Google uh, text-to-speech API, uh, and um, this is just the cable for the monitor that we're using to debug things. And then we've got audio output, which is just through a, a regular 3.5 millimeter um, audio out jack that's going to these speakers. And then the speakers are also being uh, powered via USB, which could go into uh, one of the USB ports. Um, I'm using an older model Raspberry Pi, by the way. Uh, the latest one that, we, that we're using for the project, the B Plus, has four USB ports, so I don't need to worry about running out of USB ports. And then it's just being powered um, via uh, uh, an attachment there. And this is the Occidentalist um, distribution from Adafruit, um, but we could just as well have been using the, the Raspbian distribution. So this whole uh, setup... Um, it's 22.7 degrees Celsius, and I'm looking east. It is measuring um, the, the compass heading, the uh, barometric pressure, which could give the altitude. These are all coming from this sensor here. Um, and uh, so compass heading, barometric pressure, temperature, and then gyroscope and uh, accelerometer readings as well. And basically what that can tell us is what direction the flower head is pointing in. So that'll give us some indication of wind direction. And the fact that we've got barometric pressure can A, be a, um, a weather measurement, but also if we see a sharp change in barometric pressure, uh, we might be able to tell whether the flower has fallen over. Um, but in terms of the setup, uh, we have the speakers and... Yes, and I'm looking north. By the way, I've dropped the G in looking, so it's, uh, it's sounding kind of 
folksy and, and uh, cute. It's 22.8 degrees Celsius, and I'm looking north. Yep. <laughs> and so uh, the speakers would be, you know, in the in the structure somewhere. I guess maybe in the in the flower in the um, yeah in the in the flower. And then this, um, I think we can we can uh, compactify this a bit more. But if you can imagine the I'll just, since I'm done debugging here, the monitor is disconnected and, um, and the, you know, there, there will be a connection here, but for now let's disconnect it. Um, these cables will be, so the audio cable will be plugged in, Wi-Fi, um, there will need to be this cable to USB, but it could be short, um, and so we've got something that is about is about this big if if the whole brain and sensor package is going to be sitting in the in the flower so something like this with power coming off that could be wrapped around audio coming off that could be sort of wrapped around and the wi-fi dongle so um yeah for scale i guess here's a well, here's my hand, um, and here's a tape thing, and here's a mug. <laughs> so yeah, um, that's that's what we're working with. Anyway, um, that should that should be that. <laughs>